Okay, I know we're making you hungry this morning. Starting this Friday through Sunday, the Portland Barbecue and Brews event is here. There's food, entertainment, breweries, and I mean, all the things that we love. And I always want to talk about anything involving barbecue. So I invited the owner, Aaron, and event director, Molly, here to tell us more. Hi, guys. Hello. Uh, thanks oh for having us. Oh, my gosh. Uh, thank you so much for being here. Yeah. Um, we always talk about food on this show. <laughs> And this is the first year for this event. Tell me how that just came about. Uh, yeah, it's the first annual. Um, it's been kind of brewing around for a while in my brain uh, for probably four or five years. And then uh, we just never really got it off the ground. And then, of course, you know, COVID and all that fun stuff. Yeah. Um, so we just kind of like put it on pause for a little while and just always wanted to do more like food and beer friendly events, yeah. you know. Uh, so finally got to be able to get it off the ground this year. We're very excited. And that. it's going to be in the Washington Monroe Park type area, right? It is. Yeah. I don't think a lot of people are familiar with that until you say it's next to the Revolution Hall or the old <laughs> Washington High School. Uh, it's like the field next or that the Washington High School used back yeah. in the day. So yeah, giant field, you know, great location, Southeast Portland, so. Yeah, what kind of entertainment can we expect? Cause I mean, you know, we love the barbecue, we love the food, and then that entertainment just like adds the cherry on top. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we have uh, live music all weekend. We got a bunch of great local bands playing. Um, there's a few other things we've got uh, going on, Molly. Uh, yeah, every day at 2.30, we're doing a wing contest sponsored by Fire in the Mountain. Mm. So yeah. Um, yeah, people can enter to do that. Um, We'll have, you know, it's it's an all age event, even though there is beer and everything, we do have things for the kids. We have some face painting. Um, we'll have lots of long games and like lots of local vendors for people to check out as well. Yeah. Okay, now yeah. I have to know who is gonna be the judge of this barbecue competition. I, where do I sign up? Oh, so <laughs> so it's actually a wing eating contest. And oh, okay. It's, right, sponsored okay. by uh, Fire on the Mountain. <laughs> And if you're not familiar, they have their, like, if you went into Fire on the Mountain, they do a, um, like, their El Jefe Challenge, which is oh. their hot, hottest wing. Mm. And um, you're supposed to eat, I think, a dozen on their, in their challenge. But for us, uh, it's just the fastest to eat 12 of those wings and they win. And they win a nice Ooh. little package, uh, a bunch of uh, Fire on the Mountain hot sauces, gift cards to Fire on the Mountain, um, T-shirts, yeah, and then some other good All prices the goodies. yeah so yeah. we'll do that each day so if you want to enter uh you can go on our website and enter or you can just kind of if there's still space you can walk up to that day i so, love it and yeah. molly you guys are looking for volunteers right yeah so we're excited to be you know hosting live events this year um after coming back after the last couple years um but there is a lot of work that goes into it and we wouldn't be able to do these events without our volunteers so um, you know, people can pour beer, they can help, um, you know, recycling, trash, greeters, uh, all kinds of stuff. So um, if you volunteer for a beer pouring, then, you know, then you can taste the food and beer for free afterwards. Mm. So, yeah. Um, yeah, we're looking for a lot of volunteers and you can sign up for that on our website as well. Okay. Now, where can they go? Is that a specific website? Let everybody out there know where they can go. Um, just terrapinevents.com and you'll find out, um, you can purchase tickets, uh, volunteer, find out the music schedule, all that kind of fun stuff. Yeah, all the breweries that are there, things yeah. like that. Um, yeah, and I, I think to, to piggyback on the volunteer thing, um, you know, we really need a lot of beer pourers. Mm -hmm. a, a beer festival can't I happen mean, without yeah. beer pourers, right? <laughs> so, yeah, exactly. So <laughs> we're hoping people will go online and they'll start signing up. I mean, we've got a lot of beer pourers, but we need more. An event like this can't happen without mm -hmm. a ton of volunteers. And so everyone who can sign up, that'd be great. So uh, we love it. Well, yeah. thank you so much for being here. Like I said, anytime you all want to come back, talk barbecue. This yeah. is the spot to be. Yeah, yeah. well, thanks <laughs> thank again you. for having us, for uh, sure. Oh, no problem. Yeah. Guys, it is time for our first break.